Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there are howler monkeys at Iberstar 2 Can Quetzal. They're up in the trees all over the place. I mean, our best encounter happened in the middle of the night. We're sleeping, and around 2.33 in the morning in the uh, Flamingo Pond area, up in the trees, I guess the howler monkeys decided to have an argument because in the middle of the night, they started howling and making their noise, and it didn't annoy me. I mean, I thought it was really cool, but uh, like I say, you can hear and see them most of the time. Especially if you go through the jungle area of the resort between uh, morning and noon. Look for uh, trees rustling, branches, dark shapes bouncing around, or even you might be able to hear them calling out, which we did a number of times. The reason I'm mentioning this is that on the very day we were leaving, we talked to people who've been there for almost a week and they never saw the monkeys. And then, like for me, that seems so hard to fathom because we saw them all the time. This happened to be right at the end of the theater as you're heading down towards the jungle area along the pathway. And we were just walking up and saw them up in the trees again. And how many resorts can you name where you can see monkeys jumping through the trees? Wild, wild monkeys. I mean, it's such a cool experience. So if you really want to see the monkeys and you enjoy doing things like this or you bring along kids or for yourself, aside of having a camera, if you have a small pair of binoculars, bring them. Because even though it seems like sometimes I'm really close to them, and we did get close to them like maybe 10, 15 feet away, a lot of the time they're a distance away and I can zoom in onto them with my camcorder. But... Uh, if you have binoculars, you'll be able to see them much better. And, and it's fun to watch. So now I have a whole bunch of videos of the monkeys coming up. Because for me, this is still one of those experiences that don't happen every day or at all resorts. As a matter of fact, the only two resorts where I've seen howler monkeys are the Iberstar Toucan Quetzal and the Sandoz Playa Car, which is right next door. And that was last year. So in this area, we see howler monkeys. We've traveled into Puerto Vallarta area, went up into the jungles, thought about monkeys, and we're told that they used to be there, but many years ago already the hunters had killed them off. So it's really amazing that in this uh, resort area you can still find howler monkeys, coatimundis, uh, there are uh, raccoons, all sorts of different creatures if you take the time to observe and watch. And it's just something that I enjoy doing with nature. So... Here we are with the peacocks, and then there'll be more monkeys coming up galore. Thank you for watching, and if you're going there, like I said, think about bringing along a small pair of binoculars and a camera for sure.